live from Gotham City. Good evening, Gothamites. Welcome to another episode of GCN Nightlife. Our top story tonight. There has been a riot and breakout at Blackgate Penitentiary. Seventeen police officers are in critical condition. All inmates were accounted for except for crazed serial murderer Victor Zaz. Victor Zaz was given a life sentence and put in Blackgate Penitentiary for being charged in connection with 150 different homicide cases. His sentence to Blackgate has sparked serious concern amongst Gothamites and Blackgate workers alike. So much concern to where City Council is considering reopening the Elizabeth Arkham Asylum for the criminally insane. The concern stems from Zaz's diagnosed psychosis. He's a narcissistic sociopath that suffers from illusions. On inspection, police found 237 scars on him, but could only link Zaz to 153 cases. A taped interview with the GCPD suggests that his motives for killing are because he sees us all as zombies. <laughs> well, <laughs> this is what police had to say. Shit's really f***ed up. Yeah, it is. Get these guys out of here. You want to know what's going to happen? You want to know what's going to happen? We're going to find him and he's going to rot! Now scram! Police found Zaz outside a liquor store in Lower East Gotham, standing over one Bill Morrison. Mr. Morrison was found with his throat slit, holding a cardboard sign that read zombie. We also got an interview with one of Mr. Bill Morrison's associates. Hello, sir. You were a friend of Mr. Morrison's. What do you have to say about his unfortunate demise? Well, man, this fucking guy is just uh, killing all my friends, and uh, yeah, like, how are we supposed to live on the street if everyone's getting turned to zombies, man? I just want to smoke my ganja, you know? Like, and all my, uh, my friends are all getting murdered out in the street. What is this, Gotham City or fucking, you know, hell on earth, bro? Like, ah, dude, this is whack. Something, somebody needs to do something about all this crime. Somebody needs to do something about all this corruption in the city. Man, it's really f***ed up, man. I mean, he didn't deserve to die. Now I gotta beg for money on the street, man. Like, he owed me a bunch of money. And, like, what the f***? Upon further inspection, police found that Victor was actually the heir to the Zaz family fortune, left behind by his parents, Grant and Rose, after their unfortunate boating accident. After the accident, Zaz fell into a deep depression, spending the fortune on a life of gambling, prostitution, and drugs. He lost the fortune and fell off the grid. It had been nine months since his last known location. Upon his resurface, police are warning all Gothamites to stay inside after dark and to keep their doors locked. Now our next story tonight. This granny claims that she was saved by a giant bat. My question is, if the GCPD is employing a giant bat, what's he pulling down after taxes? Find out after these messages. Hey, 